Welcome to Success Stories, brought to you by Project Dispiro, produced by the World Blind Union, NCNIB, and funded by the Ontario Trillium Foundation. In this video, you'll meet Chris Chamberlain, co-founder and president of Frontier Computing. This video includes a montage of clips that show Chris speaking with colleagues using a Perkins Brailler and talking on the phone. A range of assistive technology devices are also shown, including portable and desktop magnifiers and Braille displays. My name is Chris Chamberlain. I'm president and owner of Frontier Computing. I'm uh, totally blind. I had partial vision at birth, but as a result of congenital glaucoma, I lost all of my vision at about age seven and have been blind ever since. I had worked in a couple of different uh, sort of early careers in my life. I worked for the CNIB library for a couple of years and uh, beyond that, I worked for the Ontario Provincial Police in technical surveillance for five and a half years. If you're looking to uh, pursue entrepreneurial uh, ventures, of course it's very, very important to uh, gather some experience, as much ex experience as possible before you do it. I had already worked for almost 10 years for other people and really felt that I wanted to work for myself and uh, govern and control my own uh, actions. I realized that there were a variety of technologies available from other parts of the US and uh, Europe, and I thought exposing those to Canadians would be of great value for uh, the blind population in general, and that's when I decided it was time to uh, strike out on my own and form Frontier Computing. When we initially started uh, in terms of sort of seed money and so on, um, I actually took some of my own savings and we actually started out with about $3,500 into the company. And we sort of agreed that for the first six to eight months we wouldn't take anything out of the company either. So we were kind of feeling our way initially with uh, myself and two other employees and then we eventually sort of expanded and grew rather quickly through the mid late 80s into the 90s. We needed somebody with a vision who could do some driving for us because we needed to get out to our customers and that wasn't easy on, on uh, public transportation. My philosophy was that I had certain strengths but it was important that I hire my weaknesses. And I think that's what can make uh, you a success is identify your strengths but remember that you do have weaknesses and you need the support from others. The best part about this job in general and overall is the, the sense on an everyday basis that we are, as a uh, assistive technology company, making a difference in the lives of blind Canadians. There's nothing more rewarding than, than demonstrating a product to somebody and it's the perfect solution for them. And their reaction to that is just priceless. Mm -hmm. 